Hello Sagittarius and welcome to your December audio telescope brought to you by me Kathleen Robinson of Karma Queens and Five Tarot and just before we get started if you want to purchase a gift card for that someone special go to my link on your monthly reading and click on the rotating gift to find out more. You'll be able to purchase it online and it provides your recipient with a 45 minute Zoom or telephone reading for them to book within 18 months and it's only £38 for you to buy. So Sagittarius, you'll be brought the Page of Pentacles upright this December and it's an excellent energy to support you when you have somewhat tedious work to get accomplished. It can give you focus, backbone, on the wherewithal to stick with a task that's not necessarily glamorous or fun. Don't try to sidestep effort or you'll fall on your face. The page can indicate more work to be done than there is time to do it. But don't despair, just roll up your sleeves and get busy. The news in general is really good, but you may be feeling overwhelmed and unexcited. Remember, slow and steady rinse the race. If you need help to get things done, don't hesitate to go out and find the assistance because it is there for you. In love, if you're in a committed relationship, it may have lost its luster. That doesn't have to mean the death now, but it does mean that action and discussion is necessary. To create change, you must be honest about how you're feeling. If you're unattached and you can't seem to meet someone new, look carefully at what's you're holding in your heart. You may be still unattached to an ex and may need to let go before you can expect to move on. Financially, this card points to rewards for good old-fashioned hard work. It's not a time to gamble or be unrealistic. It's a time to put an honest appraisal on the value of your skills and efforts. And if you aren't being Fairly compensated now might be the time to make a change. Invest, don't spend. Choose traditional safe investments for now. Well, that's all that's left for me to say is I hope that you have a wonderful December, especially Christmas. And I'm really looking forward to read for you in January. So it's me, Kathleen Robertson, signing off. Until then.